in this video i will explain how to read one xml file and load into one oracle target table so that let me first go to google and uh, download one xml file so i will search sample xml file download then go to this page you can see sample xml5 uh, file uh, books xml copy this let's do one notepad plus plus and uh, save this control s i'll go to desktop i mention books type will be xml see the xml save so, file has been uh, created Now go to talent, go to metadata, then go to file XML here, generate the metadata, right click on uh, file XML, create file XML, provide a name, oops, go to next, we are selecting input XML, now browse go to desktop as the file is there in desktop this is my xml file and you can see these are the fields click on next uh, here you can see x path loop expression so this is the loop drag and drop here then uh, select the fields like id author title gender price publish date description drag and drop to the fields now refresh once you refresh you can see the data and click on next You can see the fields like ID, author, title, and the data types, the length, precisions. Click on finish. So our uh, metadata has been uh, created. <clears throat> now go to job design. A new demo. I'll create a job. J field XML. Finish. Now oh, drag and drop this books XML. Here we have to select file input XML. Now save this. As I load uh, this XML into Oracle, I need to create uh, the connections. So that I have, as I have already created the Oracle connection, I will use that here as part of pre-job. So in pre-job, before the job starts, the connection will be opened. It will be Oracle connection, the Oracle connection. Grab this, we got all component, okay. Double click on this. Then uh, select here property type as uh, repository. Then uh, select the connection. In my case, it's connection over a Scott. And I have it selected. You can see all these um, uh, details which have been already there in this connection local host, then database as ORCL, user as Scott. And then port as 1521. Similarly, I have to close the connection as part of post job. Post job. 
oracle close on component okay here you have to select the connection which needs to be closed once the job completes okay so those two are done now i have to load the xml into a oracle table so that i will uh, the table i will create during round time so for that i will select uh, oracle output oracle output now select this using this row name now double click on this database as oracle property type first we have to select the use an existing connection as we have already one connection present we have to use that so db connection one we have to select so db connection one now we have to create one uh, table during on time so mention the table name like uh, tjt xml tjt xml books and action on table as the table won't be there uh, during first round so we'll mention create table if it doesn't exist then uh, we have to sync the columns so it means uh, whatever fields are there in the source file same uh, same fields will be created in the target table so in that case uh, click on this sync columns now save it then run the job go to run and run the job as you can see the xml file has 12 records and the job has completed let's see what was the table i have mentioned here tgt xml books now go to oracle tgt xml books that uh, table is not there now let me refresh this you can see tgt xml books the table has been created and as you know there are 12 records coming from source and 12 records have been loaded to the oracle target table and it has like id author title gen price publish date descriptions so in this way one can read data from xml file and load to any of the targets like oracle or flat file or any uh, target tables thank you